whenever people know that you truly believe in what you're doing, they believe also. Brian Irwin's belief in his family-run business, WD Irwin & Sons, has led to him developing the largest indigenous bakery in Northern Ireland, while also growing property development and sand and aggregates enterprises. Recent developments at the bakery have included low GI white bread and a range of speciality Irish breads. It is a family business. After getting what passed for an education, I ended up in the business. Very often the, the conversation around the meal table with my father and my brother there always turned to the, the issues of the day. So business was a natural thing for me. Our businesses are very different and they, as a result, are complementary. The sand and aggregates business has been with us for maybe uh, 60 years. The bakery for maybe uh, 80 or 90 years. The property division started whenever we relocated our bakery from a town centre site. We were able to turn that site into a redevelopment project. The range of products that are most exciting for us at the moment are a range of traditional Irish products, which we have branded Rank and Selection. And that's a cooperative venture between Irwin's Bakery and Paul Rankin. Paul is an extremely well-known celebrity chef, and the coming together of his reputation and his uh, skills have meant that we've been able to deliver the bread in a new form, with a new appearance, with up-to-date tastes and textures, to a whole new uh, public. I think with that apple tart, we can take over the world. <laughs> To get away with my family, I really like to get on board my boat, get everybody together, do a bit of water skiing, something that's not competitive and is full of fresh air. I came to it only a couple of years ago and it was fun learning and you make a few mistakes but it's worth it. The comparison I would put between water skiing and business is you must have confidence. If you don't have confidence then you're bound to fail. Confidence has got to be strong because you've got to have a lot of duckings in the water. There's going to be a lot of times when you're almost under and you've got to have that uh, confidence in yourself to get back up again.